Welcome. I've got uh, the new parts here that I've developed. Uh, we're going to do some durability testing on the different materials. So grab the safety goggles, put those bad boys on, and you ask, how are we going to durability test? Uh, usually uh, the weak part that I found in this, uh, the part that takes most of the load are these, these front ears here. So what I've done is I've mounted uh, an elongated uh, ball stud, and we're going to apply some leverage. So, really, just what we're going to do is we're going to hit both of them, uh, see how much force it takes to break it. Uh, it's not going to be super scientific, so we're not going to have a load on it to see what, uh, uh, any kind of meter to see how much it takes. So we're just going to beat it, and yeah, you'll see for yourself. This one's not too bad, but yeah, as you can see, it, it breaks. That's about where it normally breaks. Uh, this is uh, PLA, so it's a pretty hard plastic, but it's also brittle because it's hard. It's great for, uh, uh, yeah, it's, it's great for structural parts, but it's not so good against uh, parts that need to take an impact. Uh, this is the part from Shapeways, uh, exact same part. I had them print, and it's made from their strong and flexible nylon. Still not doing anything. <laughs> wow. So I broke the ball stud instead of the plastic. You have a better chance of breaking your ball stud than you do that. Just like you would with an aluminum one. So that just goes to show you this plastic is stronger than you think. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time.